The Downtown Medford Association met with Medford Police last night to talk about safety in the area. NBC 5's Derek Strom is live in our newsroom with what was covered in that meeting. Derek? Craig, the meeting included a presentation from MPD with some areas where progress has been made and some areas for improvement. MPD says it's hoping to expand its downtown team to cover nights and weekends. Since September of 2022, the amount of dispatch calls downtown are down 22 percent, according to MPD. There's also been an 80 percent decrease in assaults in the same area, but MPD says there have been large increases in drug use and overdoses. Proven more than once that the pilot program is successful. The challenge is, is that there's limited funding and then there's limited police uh, officers available. Despite MPD's statistics showing decreasing harassment and assaults, many business owners still had concerns about their safety. MPD says the lack of space in the Jackson County Jail makes law enforcement less effective. Medford Police says once the school year ends in June, it can also shift school resource officers to downtown. It says it will continue to make more resources available to business owners. Live in the newsroom, Derek Strom, NBC5 News.